Hi everyone! I have a Stampin' Up! haul to share with you. I ordered a ton of stuff. And this is what I've been waiting on because when I did the pre-order I didn't order a whole lot for, you know, money reasons. I didn't have money at the time uh, to really spend on it. So I just bought a few things to get me started and I think that's part of the reason why I haven't had too much inspiration lately because I just, there's only so much you can do with one stamp set continuously. I mean, you can think of something to do with it, like, you know, if you've owned it for a while and whatever, but if you're just simply working with the same stamp set day after day after day, you're going to get burned out. That's me anyways. But anyways, so my my order came, two of my orders came. I had, This is an order that had some customer stuff in it. Um... So I'm not going to show you the what the customer ordered, but um, I have um, the Big Shot uh, Fry Box die now, so I can do some cool projects with that. I got the um, this is really awesome if you haven't seen it yet. Project kit for uh, kit. Uh, I can talk really. Project Kit Tin of Cards. Um, if you haven't seen the Tin of Cards yet, uh, it's amazing. Um, and I will do a video when I do that so that you can see it. Um, I got a ton of stamp sets. Um, I'll go through them quickly for you. Talented Trio. Look at that. Look how cute those girls are. Oh my gosh. Loving it. And then I got, uh, you guys know I love my florals and nature stuff, so I got Awesomely Artistic, and I'm loving this already. I the, I could not wait to open these boxes. <laughs> my husband came home with them, and I'm, I'm like, I gotta open them. Uh, this is the stamp set that goes with the tin of cards, and it looks like that. Very cute. This one uh, I got in the bundle with the fry box die. This is all about sugar. And it's so cute. And then I got the uh, cupcakes party. Which I don't know what took me so long to get this. But I got this in a bundle with the cupcake punch. And then I got this one. Which is the hardwood background and then I got some of our new um, tape this is uh, Terran tape adhesive it's kind of like score tape I haven't tried it yet but I will let you know what I think of it once I do and you get quite a bit on the roll um, and I think that's going to come in handy for uh, when you're making boxes and things like that so, I got that, and then I got some of the sequin trim. This is, uh, Blushing Bride sequin trim. And then I got some real red, um, woven satin ribbon is what that is. And that was on the clearance rack. And then these two were on the weekly deals. This is the, uh, just one second, sorry, satin ribbon. I got the silver and the whisper white. And then I got, uh, Stampin' Up! is now carrying some 6x6 six six, uh, embossing folders. And this is one of them. This gorgeous butterfly one. This is, uh, Fluttering textured impressions embossing folder. So that's that. So pretty. And then I got the brick wall, which is also very cool. And then I got this die. This is um, gift card envelope and things, thin lit die. And I believe this was um, on the clearance or or weekly specials. I'm not quite sure which one. Weekly deals. I'm not sure which one it was, but I know it was a discounted price. And then I got some of the um, Pretty Petals Designer Series paper. This is a 6x6 paper pack. And if you'd like to see the paper pack um, 
you know, I could do a flip through of it. Uh, just let me know in the comments below and I will do that for you. And then I got... Color Me Irresist Irresistible Specialty Designer Series Paper. And these are embossed resist paper. And if you want to see that in detail, let me know. I'll do a video on that. And then in the last one in this box is the 2015-2017 um, In Color Designer Series Paper Pack. And uh, this here has... Uh, everything just fell. <laughs> oh, here we go. 40 pages, 40 papers. They're double-sided. Um, so you get eight of each color. And I don't know if you can see that, but if you want to see that in detail, let me know. I'll do a video. So let me just put all this back in that box and I'll skip on over here. And in this box, this is a partial order. I'm still waiting for another box to come, but I got a ton more stamp sets. Um, you guys know I love my stamps. <laughs> this one's called Hey Girl. Look how cute she is. And she can carry a purse, flowers, a cell phone. She can uh, walk her dog with the leash right there. Uh, so cute. So cute. And the sentiment says, Know what I like best about your birthday? And then it says, You. And then this one down here says, Hey Girl. Sorry, <laughs> I was mesmerized. Then I got um, sprinkles on top. This one's got donuts. How cute is that? Sometimes it's better not to remember how many you've had. <laughs> Very true. Happy birthday. Hope it's sweet. Some candles and a little piece of candy at top. So cute. And then I got the watercolor wash. Uh, I believe that's a background stamp there. And this one's called Over the Rainbow. I cannot wait to play with this one. I've seen so many cute projects with this so far. Um, so I got that one. Then we got Watercolor Words. You see a watercolor thing going on here? <laughs> Then we got watercolor wings, and I cannot wait, cannot, cannot wait to play with this. My um, one of my uplines, Patty Bennett, did a video on her channel, and I will link it down below so you can go check it out. Um, on coloring tips on coloring these uh, butterflies, I cannot even wait, cannot even wait to play with that. <laughs> Can you tell I'm in love? <laughs> and then I got, uh, let's see, best thoughts. This is a hostess set. So if you uh, host a party and uh, you earn Stampin' Rewards, you can use it to redeem it for this stamp set here. So cute. And let's see, next we have a whole lot of lovely, which looks like this. And this is also a hostess set. So cute. And the last stamp set I got for now is Floral floral Wings. And it looks like this. Comes with a little vase and some roses there or flowers. And a vine and a big butterfly. So cute. I'm just so loving <laughs> everything that came out in this new catalog I can't even tell you and then I got some more of the um, white tea lace paper doilies I ordered some of the gold ones but they haven't come in yet um, then I got metal rimmed pearls these are a uh, new item from Stampin' Up I don't know I don't I can't take them out of the bag by myself but that's kind of what they look like so there's that and I got some more 6x6 paper pads I got the pretty petals apparently I like that one because I got it twice 
<laughs> and then I got Go Wild designer paper. And if if you want to see these paper uh, packs in detail, just let me know. I'll do a flip through for you. I got some of the new Whisper White uh, thick cardstock. This is 100 pound cardstock. And uh, just ignore what it says right there. It says 80 pound, but that was a typo. Um, we got a memo from Stampin' Up! telling us so. So I cannot wait to try this. It's supposed to be thicker than our normal Whisper White uh, cardstock. So it'll make great card bases and, um, you know, sturdier embellishments and that sort of thing. But the um, regular Whisper White is still great to use for die cutting and that sort of thing. Um, and this is supposed to be ultra smooth so that you can color on it and get great results. And then I got this beautiful, beautiful, beautiful paper. <laughs> can I say beautiful enough times? Um, this one's called English Garden Designer Series Paper. And if you want to see a flip through of that, let me know in the comments. I will do it for you. And then I ordered a whole bunch of... Um, the wood mounted stamp cases because I'm transferring all of my old wood stamps into these and taking them out of the clamshell style cases and I got some of the half cases and I have I ordered a lot more than that so I know there's another box coming and I know there's more stuff coming that is not in this order so there you go there's my massive Stampin' Up! haulage so I have lots to play with, so I, that means I have lots of videos to make for you guys. If you have a request for anything you'd like to see, just let me know and I will uh, put it on my list of videos to make. I have a list of about six videos right now that were by request, so I have to do those first. But I would... Sorry, my camera cut out. So what I was saying is, if you'd like to request a video, just le let me know. Leave it in the comments below. I'll put you on my list, and then I go down the list and do the videos in order. So that, um, you know, it's kind of fair. And hopefully it doesn't take too long to get the video out that you're requesting. But, uh, anyway, that's it. I hope you guys are having a wonderful weekend. I know I am. I'm about to play with me some Stampin' Up! stuff. Alright guys, have a great, great one. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye!